Welcome to MagiTools. Here's how to export images in Canva with 300 dpi. First of all, let me create a design, custom dimensions, 1000 by 1000 pixels. You can choose whatever you want here. Create new design. Now let me choose a random photo here of Canva's photo library. Now the problem is as following. Whenever you're going to download an image as a JPEG or a PNG file, to do that just click here on download and then choose the file type either PNG or JPEG. Whenever you're going to do that, the problem is that these files will be exported with a DPI of either 72 or 96 DPI at most. Now, depending on your preferred usage of these images, that might be enough. If you're just uploading these images on your blog, for example, that might be totally fine. But for some other uses, as for example, print on demand services, 72 or 96 DPI is far too low. For these kind of services, a DPI of 300 or more is usually desirable. So here's how to export images in Canva with a DPI of 300. The solution is actually pretty simple. Instead of exporting an image as a PNG or a JPEG, you will have to export it as a PDF print. Now when downloading an image as a PDF print, you will see that your image will actually be at 300 DPI. Here's the file that I just downloaded. And I can promise you that the DPI will be set at 300. However, there's obviously still a problem because you don't want to end up with a PDF file, but you would like to have the picture as a PNG or a JPEG. So now to achieve that, we have to use a converter. To convert your image in this PDF to either JPEG or PNG, you can use one of two converters. You will find the link to these converters in the description. They are totally free. This here, pdfconvertonline.com, is a free PDF to JPEG converter. So now let me show you how I can convert our PDF to a JPEG, which still has those 300 DPI. First of all, I'm just gonna choose the file here. Then I'm gonna select image one, as that is the file that I just saved before. Click on open. And then as far as the DPI go here, just insert 300. And you could probably even change the JPEG quality here and make it a bit higher if you want and then click on convert now. After your file has been converted, you will find it here in the output section. Just click on it and you will get your picture as a JPEG. Now to save it on your computer, just right click it and then choose save image as. And then when you verify the DPI of your image, uh, if you are on a Mac, you can do that in the preview tool here. Just click on tools and then show inspector. And you will see that our image DPI is exactly at 300. Now, if you would like to convert your PDF into a PNG rather than a JPEG, you can just use the PDF to PNG converter that you see here on the screen. As mentioned before, you will find the link to these tools in the description of the video. The process now here is exactly the same. Just choose the file here that you downloaded from Canva, adjust the render DPI, click on convert now, and then you can simply download your new file. So that's it, how to download images with a DPI of 300 and then how to convert them from a PDF into either a JPEG or a PNG. Now that your image will have a DPI of 300, you will be able to upload it to a print-on-demand service such as Redbubble. Because lots of these services have this as a requirement. They won't accept files with DPIs below 300. If you did indeed enjoy this video, I would be most grateful if you could subscribe to my channel and in that case, please don't forget to hit the notification bell. Have a great day guys, bye!